How am I supposed to get my errands done if you keep looking at me like that? Forget about your parents. What about Tad? Isn't this supposed to be your brotherly bonding time? You're a lot sexier than Tad. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Look at this. Mm. Mr. and Mrs. Rabbit are at it again. Mm. What am I walking on this time? Mm. Amanda was just saying how ugly you were. Well, I, I was You were too. You just said it. You were very handsome. Fibber. Oh, yeah? You like credit cards? Uh -huh. Join us for a drink? Disgusting. <gasps> Maybe next time. You two play nicer. Bye, babe. Happy you scared her off. What was that? What was that? Yeah, I mean, it blew out of here in a hurry. What did I say? <laughs> she probably thinks that we are gonna talk about David, which we are. You see, let me explain something to you. Women are a lot more complicated than us men. Really? Oh, yeah, yeah. See, when it comes to David, she's got thoughts, and she actually has sympathy for the devil. Is that a song? Finish. She has a heart. That's all I'm saying. You know, you're right about one thing. It's easier being a guy. We got nothing to feel guilty about. Hey guys. Been a rough day, huh? Okay. Please, can I buy you guys a drink? <laughs> Great. So this is just how it's gonna be now, huh? I get the cold shoulder everywhere I go. What'd you expect? Told Randy everything that she PVAD. PVAD? Yes. Pine Valley after David. The sun is sunnier, the air is airier, and the beer is beerier. Salute. Mm -mm. What was that? That's unacceptable what you did there. That was a wussy move. I'm pacing myself. You're pacing yourself? Really? That's what you're doing? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Man, Eliza got you depressed? No. Then what? What is it? You know, it depends on how you look at it. It might not be that right to celebrate, you know, when the way Hayward died could cause trouble for so many people even I care about. See, there you go. You're talking about oh, again, so the speak of the devil. Yeah, that's right. And that Pine Valley's number one murder suspect and king of memory loss. Nothing ringing a bell yet? No, I even tried hypnosis. You know how desperate I am. I got nothing. Nothing new. Just give it some time. Give it some time. But I, but I don't, I don't have any time, which is, which is why I hired the world's best PI to crack the case. Mm. I should bring him around sometime, introduce him to Ted, give him some pointers. Such a chip. Listen, I, I, I meant what I said. I'm not sure this is a good idea. I gotta do this, Ted. I, I, I gotta get some more pieces to the puzzle here and put them together. They couldn't. I don't know, there could be somebody out there, another witness. Somebody that saw something that went down in the hotel room. What if it was? Are you sure you want me to find them? Yes, I gotta do this. I, I have to know. <sighs> Ryan, look, this is gonna sound strange, but if, if I had done something like this, disposed to somebody like Hayward, it would be tough, but I could find a way to live with it. I wanted to kill him many times. Because of what he did to my family, I, I would have felt justified. You, you're different, okay? There's no way on earth you're going to be okay with this. A moral compass of yours would point you right straight to prison. Mm, that's true. Leave it alone, okay? In this case, ignorance really is bliss. Guys, but I gotta tell you, from, from my perspective, you two are the upstanding ones, and, and I'm, I'm the one who has been known to have some pretty morally challenged moments, especially when anger gets the best of me. Ryan. And Hayward is very, very skillful. Ryan, and how many times do I have to say it? Whatever happened that night, you're better off not knowing. Okay, the bottom line is I was angry enough to kill him, Dad. Doesn't mean you did it. But whatever David did to Greenlee that night, it scared her enough to, to want to stay with him. And I, and I find this out, right? So I, I, go, I go to Hayward, and my intention is to keep him away from Greenlee. That's what I go there with the intention. And, and I did it. You know what? Hayward is permanently away from Greenlee. So no matter what happens, I mean, the truth is going to come out here. And you may go to prison. The bottom line is, is if I did this, I would be able to live with it because I, I would know that there was a reason. It's the only way to stop David from hurting people. All right. Have it your way. Let's just say if I find something that the cops could use against you, it might disappear. I'm just saying.
Be careful. You know there's wild DAs out here, right? Very dangerous. Liza. No, I'm serious. I could attack you at any given moment. Okay, point taken. I suppose that was a little harsh bit. <laughs> a little harsh. It's just yeah. that this whole Hayward thing's got everybody on edge, you know, and seeing you brings up certain feelings. But like hate. No. Hmm. More like disappointment. And I gotta be honest, I'm not the only one that feels that way. There's a man that was murdered. Ryan Lavery is the prime suspect. And everybody here just wants me to turn the other way. Ryan Lavery is a good man. He's got friends, he's got family. And Hayward was Hayward. He asked me the real crime would be letting Ryan go to prison for doing something like that. The law doesn't give a pass to the popular guy. I'm sorry, there was a crime committed. He has to pay. When I step back and take a few deep breaths, I know you've got a job to do. Well, that was the nicest thing you've said to me in weeks. I just wish to God you didn't seem to enjoy it so much. Well. Good luck with everything. What is it? What's wrong? Nothing. It's, um... Hard to explain. Okay, sit down. No, you need to sit too. You're gonna need to for this. I just find it amazing that after all these years, you don't know me. I know you're the new DA. The one is going after Ryan without mercy. Do I take pride in my work? Damn right. Do I want to be the best? Hell yes. I didn't go back to law school at my age and bust my butt just to become a another attorney. I want to be the best. I want to be respected, and I want to be recognized. Well, you'll be recognized, all right. And if you don't know how much this is absolutely killing me to go after one of the finest men in this town, you just don't know me. That's it. You're really going to offend David. Everything he was, everything he did, all the people he hurt. You know, everybody in this town just thinks that David was just evil. He wasn't. Yeah, I do. I have a little sympathy for him. As a man that made mistakes because he was in pain. Listen, until you have felt what he's felt, Dad, who are you to judge? That's how you see it? All I know is that you and Jake and everybody else in this town is going to go dance on his grave. I can't. That man is gone. Well, that's the thing, Liza. I get the impression that Hayward will never really be gone. Because, say what you will about the guy, he did make an impression. Well, nothing lasts forever, right? I guess not. I have news. Is it bad? Depends on who you ask. Suicide? 